Delta Woo. Flyers. They are in Memphis this week. They are part of the 25th annual International Blues Challenge. You've got to jump up on stage here. To stand up? No, you sit right there. You guys are the stars. Do not move at all. We've Thank got Stevie. We've got Travis. Y'all yeah. are disparate in age, and that's kind of what makes this work. We got your years of experience and your a uh, lot of hip good looks. Under the, well, hip yeah. good looks. I was trying not to be forward. Steve. He draws most of the audience. Uh -huh. <laughs> and talk about an audience. We were talking before we went on the air this morning that you guys have quite a fan base. A lot of folks are going to be watching this morning over in the UK, the United Kingdom. Yes. How did that fan base really just grow over the years? Um, actually, I, I have a, a close friend who is a, a, a tour manager in place, but mostly. Um, I started back playing music in 2003. I took a long break uh, to raise children, and um, I used the internet to its fullest capability. When I uh -huh. when I when I stopped playing, we didn't have any internet. So when I got back, <laughs> I just got airplay in, in in the United Kingdom and and met some people with similar musical interests, and and uh, now the fan base has grown. And we actually went over there in 2005 and played for several weeks and. Um, um, I just want to say hi to Maria Danes and Mary Alice, and y'all keep trucking. Well, keep they're trucking watching. for sure. They're watching. When did your love of the blues start? Because you are a uh, young guy. I mean, you know? Yeah. Uh, well, I guess uh, growing up in Texas, there's a lot of things that are bluesy, you know, like that I grew up listening to ZZ Top and uh, mm -hmm. Kinda things like, roots like the, that, you know. Yeah. And I guess... Uh, uh, maybe when I was about 25, I met Stevie and started playing some songs that he had written and uh, did some studio work for him. And from there, I started getting into the more older traditional things. And very know. quickly here, what are your thoughts about being here as part of the International Blues Challenge, Memphis, Tennessee? Uh, well, it's my first time in Memphis. Um, I like the weather. Um, I don't know. I'm excited. Yeah. You know, just the... to be a part of the, the whole thing. All right, we're blues. excited to have you guys here as and well. And got your 2007 album. I'm holding it upside down uh, on the Levee Road. We can get it off your website. Yes, you can. Uh, and CD Baby. Wonderful. CD Baby. And you guys perform actually, I believe, tonight. Yes, we're <clears throat> we're going to perform um, before the Memphis Grizzlies game tonight. It just so happens the Houston Rockets are in town, and so we're kind of representing <laughs> the Houston Rockets and uh, uh, some other members. Uh, uh, that our IBC participants are going to play and uh, uh, cool. last year's second place winner Shakira Saida okay. is going to do the national anthem. Excellent. We'll, we'll try not to beat the Rockets too badly. All okay. Right. Delta we'll Flyers, be sure to check them out and be also checking out the folks with the International Blues Challenge as well. Always. Yeah. We'll be back.